How you've convinced me, Ron. I'm really sorry that I said I nailed your daughter. Because I didn't. Not because I couldn't, but because I fucking wouldn't want to. Anyways, I've been messaging you all day, trying to set up a time and a place. All you do is keep making fucking videos, and saying stupid shit. Do you accept the fight or do you not? Again, I'll say it so everybody knows. Me and you, we're gonna kickbox. No time limit. First person to quit or get knocked out loses. That simple. It gets videotaped. Everybody sees it. There won't be a question in anyone's mind. There'll be no excuses. I'm coming to you, most likely, because I know you can't come to me. That's it. <laughs> Any need to talk shit beyond that, you're just fucking wasting my time. And you know what? I'm not fucking... I'm not doing it. If you want to get this done, we're going to do it. If I fucking show up to your gym randomly, you ain't going to fucking... You ain't going to be there. First off, because you don't fucking train. You say you train, you go there and hit a fucking back for a minute, videotape, and think that's working out. Ron, you're in terrible shape. You're breathing harder than a motherfucker. You sit there calling me fat Ron. At least I can fucking spar 10 rounds. You can't, honestly. I keep up with fucking welterweights. Ron, you, you're like a guy that's never fought. Motherfucker, you're like a guy that smokes cigarettes and drinks a fucking liter of whiskey every day. You're not in good shape, you're not fast, you don't have any technique, you're not strong. Dude, it doesn't matter if you have the label pro behind your fucking name. Pro, Ron, I'm up. You, what good pro have you fought that you've actually, been? you fought a few good pros, you know, some of them that I actually know, and that are cool guys, and that are good fighters, but the one I know almost broke your fucking arm in half. I mean, seriously, in under two minutes. You're out of your fucking element. That's my proposition. Me and you, and I would say let's fight, but honestly, I don't want the excuse. Because if I take you down and pound you out, you're just going to say it's a side advantage. Let's fucking strike. Me and you. Kickboxing. We'll fucking use all the fucking proper equipment so you can't get injured through Bellator, you know, debut that you say you have going on. We'll just do it that way. So that way there's no fucking question in anyone's mind. Who, who the better fighter is because if we just straight up fight I'm gonna wrap you up take you down and pound you out or I'll fucking break your arm too I don't give a shit because Ron you ain't nothing on the ground once you get on your back you're a fucking beetle fuck I've seen you tap to fucking getting kicked in the leg I mean dude the fights that I've been in may have been at the amateur level but I still show more heart and I still show more skill than you ever did and I don't even fucking fuck I got a day job I'm just a normal guy that does this shit for fucking fun. You act like you're some fucking legend or a good fighter, dude, just because you got the label pro behind you. That don't mean shit, dude. That don't mean nothing. Because I'm willing to fucking do this, and it doesn't seem like you are. So, one last time. Final fucking time I'm asking, and this is the last video I'm going to send your stupid, toothless, retarded fucking ass. Me and you, kickbox, no time limit. First person to quit or get knocked out, and knockout means a 10 count from somebody that'll be there, loses. That's it. Afterwards, there's no fucking shit talk. There's no fucking bullshit. It's going to be on video. There's no excuses. If you give up or you get knocked out, there's no excuse. That's on you. You've got that much skill that you can fucking knock me out, that you can fucking make me quit. I'd love to see you fucking do that. You might, you might, you might do all right for a minute or two. I mean, I'll admit that you might do all right. I'm not, you know, I'm not the best, but you're fucking terrible. You're a disgrace to every fucking pro fighter. Being a pro fighter should mean something, but because of guys like you, it doesn't. That's all I got to say about it, man. You know, if you really are a true fighter, you'd put all the effort you put into making these stupid fucking videos and fucking talking all this shit and you put it into learning some new skills that are legitimate gym. You'd actually go and learn from like legitimate black belts. You'd actually go and be humbled by sparring with guys that are better than you. Like I fucking do. You, you just, you never leave your comfort zone. Your comfort zone is behind a fucking keyboard, behind a phone talking shit. Dude, I'll come to your gym and you can do this. Otherwise, I'm done talking. That's it. 
You can sit and throw insults all day, motherfucker. I'll end your metaphorical life with the insults I can come up with right now. But I don't need to do that, man. You know what I need to do? I need to hear from you if this is going to happen or not. And if it's not, then, hey, best of luck in your, you know, your endeavors or whatever. If you want to do it, let's me and you both figure out a fucking time. Why don't you prove everybody fucking wrong? Because you know what? People might be saying that they think you're going to fucking beat me up. Dude, nobody really does. They know you suck. So prove me wrong. Prove everyone wrong. Do, you know, silence the hate. Beat my fucking ass. It's going to get videotaped. It's going to be fucking on YouTube, on Facebook. You know what? Knock me the fuck up. Make me quit. Make me tell you I'm sorry. You know? So that's it, Rod. Last fucking thing I'm gonna say to you. Accept the fight or shut the fuck up. That's it. And you're not gonna come find me around because you know what? If you ever fucking ever, ever, ever were trying to do some sneak up on me shit, I will blow you in fucking half, dude. I would I'll end your life, dude. If you ever tried to sneak up on me and try to fucking do some crazy shit like that, I'll kill you. This is real life, dude. This isn't the fucking little game. This isn't pro wrestling, dude. This is real life. If you want to fucking fight at the, at the gym, you know, you know, see who's the better striker, who's the better fighter, let's do that. But if you think you're ever going to fucking get one over on me and sneak up on me or come and find where I'm at or come to my places of business or, you know, come to my house, I'll fucking kill you. That's it. I, I'm not fucking, there's not a fucking ounce of doubt in that. Quit your fucking crazy talk, Ron, because there's some people that don't have to act crazy and that actually are. You know, that's all I'm going to tell you about that. So I think I've covered all my bases. Accept it or shut the fuck up. And that's it. Goodbye, Ron.